What's up everybody? Assalamu alaikum. Hope you're doing okay. Welcome to another episode of NFT Buzz. My name is Rami Safa. I'm a digital artist, an art collector, and a general fan of the NFT space. In today's video, I have three super exciting projects that I'm going to be talking about. I'm not going to be doing our usual $100 in Ethereum giveaway because I have a bunch of whitelists that I'm going to be giving away in today's video. So you got to watch the video because I have to get into the projects before I can announce them. So let's get started with the video. The first project that I'm going to be talking about is called squiggles now this is a 3d derivative 3d version of the super popular project doodles and it has been getting a lot of hype so you have around 90,000 on twitter 250,000 members on discord and the community chats they're insane right they're they're crazy if you go into their discord if you check their general chat it just goes up like this so you cannot keep up and clearly the community is super excited about this i'm going to talk about the art for just a second which obviously looks very very cool so these guys have kind of played around with the 3d textures and the surfaces on these characters some of them are matte and then some of these have like this wet shiny almost like a bubble gum texture to them you know super super cool if you're a fan of doodles this is probably something that you are either expecting or hoping to drop because if you couldn't get in on the doodles this is clearly something that you would end up getting for a lot cheaper and it's 3d now let's quickly check their website for the roadmap so now Number one, the squiggles would be metaverse ready. Number two, they're building a treasury that will allow holders to earn passive income. And then they're building a launch pad for their community where talented people can get a chance to be supported, especially artists. So obviously that's super cool. Then they're planning to buy 2D doodles. And finally, there's going to be a merch store. So I'm super hyped about this. And I have five whitelists for you guys to win in this video. And all you have to do is get in the comments, write something funny, write a funny comment or a story put your discord id in there and put hashtag squiggles in there so that i know that the comment is obviously for the whitelist and not just a random comment okay so do that and you could potentially win one whitelist for squiggles next up we have an incredible play to earn game called clementine's nightmare and my god this is beautiful so i'm just gonna take you guys to the website which by the way is probably one of the best websites that i've seen for any project in the nft space so far like this is amazing so the main story revolves around this girl named clementine who is surrounded by creatures from her nightmares and everybody around her including people from her town have basically turned into these nightmarish monsters this is what clementine looks like and i love the crazy whimsical details that these guys have actually put into the character if you look at her main weapon which is apparently a gun you have a combination of different you know things like a trumpet a shotgun and what looks like tentacles of an octopus so super cool love the character design on this we're gonna have two phases to the mint the pre-sale is gonna be for 5,000 genesis nfts that will be launching in february and then part two will be another collection that will launch in March with a supply of 10,000. We are going to have a bunch of different characters in each of these launches and they're doing a lot of traits, man, which makes me super excited because when there are so many traits involved in the art, of you know any nft project it means that you will have a lot of unique looking nfts which which obviously is super cool now before the launch of the main game all nft holders will get a bunch of airdrops of cosmetic items and accessories for their playable nfts as well as ink tokens that can be used in the game to purchase various items as holders we would also be getting access to the alpha and beta versions of the game now these guys have developed a super rich storyline with some insane characters that are obviously physical manifestations of Clementine's nightmares. And like I said before, man, the art is beautiful. It's creepy, it's eerie, but it's also like super dynamic and popping with personality. And you know, it makes sense because the team behind the project is incredibly talented with over 25 years of experience in the gaming industry, with the founder of the game also being a lead developer at Coinbase for over four years. So, you know, like a super solid portfolio. These guys are like a very experienced and a very talented unit. And the way these these guys have set up everything i'm not surprised that this is probably going to be one of the best play to earn games this year and i've spoken about this before play to earn games are going to be big because you know all the big players were kind of on the sidelines they were watching the nft space from the shadows but 
they're now jumping in and you have all this incredible talent you know major companies major gaming studios big popular artists jumping into the space so i'm super excited for this one man now obviously this is a developing project and there's going to be a lot of information coming out i will be posting regular updates probably on my twitter so you know if you want to like get in touch just drop me a follow on twitter make sure you follow the correct account it's yaramish og y-a-r R-A-M-I-S-H-O-G. There's an impersonator out there and I don't want you guys to follow that dude and get scammed or something. So, you know, just make sure you follow this. Now, the last project in today's video is a project called Punk X. There's not a lot of information on this project right now, but these guys have still managed to go really, really big. Around 19,000 members on Twitter, almost 50,000 on the Discord. And the community is pretty crazy. It's pretty organic, but they're very, very involved right now. And that makes me feel like, obviously, the project is probably going to do good now this is obviously a derivative of crypto punks but based on the art that these guys have shared in the sneak peeks i'm getting this post-apocalyptic mutant vibe from them you know the art is sick dude lots of crazy masks and high-tech gadgets and then one of them you know one of these guys is literally on fire it's also kind of giving me like a mad maxish vibe and I, I love that i love that movie love these characters now it's been a while since i saw a good punk derivative project the last one that i could remember is uh humanoids and I remember that that one did really, really well. So, you know, I've got my hopes high for this one as well. And I really hope that the community comes through. That was it for today's video. If you liked it, drop one of these. Uh, if you have any projects that you want me to check out or feature on this channel, drop me, you know, a message, a DM on Twitter, or just drop me a comment under this video and I will definitely check them out. This was fun. I'm going to run. Take care.